guys are back with another Dharma Man video for you guys today. This one is called Homeless Man Teaches Rich Man a Lesson He'll Never Forget. I feel like I've seen this video before, but I guess we'll find out. I, I just saw, th this is super random, but I just went into my mom's room, right? And I saw a bunch of photos from me like when I was younger. 2013, I saw myself and I was like, bro. I just took Leon. Then I looked at my grad, the high school grad in 2017. And I looked so cute. Like, I, I, I looked at it, I was like, oh my god, it looks so freaking good, what the hell happened? Now I look like this. <laughs> hey, if you guys want to see some old photo, photos of me, let me know, because I got some old photos. They're all cute. I don't know what happened. But, anyways, that's super random. <laughs> but, we're here, not for that reason, we're here for this. So, homeless man teaches rich man a lesson. Never forget, I see a video or a sign, need money for medicine for my son, please help. It's always hard when you have like medical bills to pay and you have no money and it's just like it's so hard This video is almost five minutes long. Let's go guys. Be sure to like comment and subscribe as well Of course this guy is gonna be the asshole guaranteed Any spare change sir? Please It's for my son He's very sick Need medicine for my son Please 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 Again, it's just assuming that he has another son. Don't assume. Don't worry, son. We're gonna get you better soon. Don't worry about me. Take care of yourself. Aww. What do you mean, don't worry about you? Just leave everything to your dad. Okay? <laughs> Wait. You need this one that I do. Thank you, sir. Yeah, he doesn't even How care about himself. He, he he just wants his dad to be okay, even though he's he's the one that's sick. He wants his dad to be okay. Hi, come on. I need some medicine. My son is very sick. No problem. Um, do you have any medical insurance? Yes. Here you go. Uh, I'm sorry, sir, but this is expired. I lost my job. Mm. I don't have much. You can take it all. I'm, I'm sorry, sir, but this isn't going to be enough. Please, sir. It's for my son. I really wish I could do more. The only thing he can do is pay for it, but... Don't worry about me. Take care of yourself. Just take anything to me. Uh, where did he get a marker from? And again, that could be fake. Like, it definitely could be a fake sign for, you know, someone for wanting drugs. But don't assume that that's what it's for. Any spare change, Read the sign first. Please. Do something. It's for my son. He's very sick. Need medicine for my son. It'd probably be better if the son was with him. Yeah, right. For your son? More like to get drunk, huh? You're pathetic. Mm, I'm the pathetic one. Uh, says, says Mr. Says Mr. Douchebag over here. Excuse me, sir. Have you seen a guy with a uh, dirty white shirt, black pants? Yeah, I just missed him. Why? Uh, he came into the pharmacy earlier today trying to get some medicine for his son. Poor guy, he got laid off and didn't have any And now he's like, oh, fuck, see, idiot. He's just trying to help his son. Thank you. When somebody is going through a hard time, we're often quicker to give judgment than to actually give help. That's fine. When someone asks us for money, we can pretend not to hear them. Or when someone asks us for support, we can pretend not to see them. 
Many times when someone is struggling, it isn't because that person's an alcoholic or is lazy or even a failure. Just rough times. They may actually just be trying their best, but they're going through a difficult time or having some temporary bad luck. It's not easy for a person to ask for help. It can even be more difficult on the person asking than on the person giving. We all face difficult times in our life, so we shouldn't be so quick to judge, especially when we don't even know their circumstances. Because one day, we might find ourselves needing the help of others, so we should always be the person that we wish we had if we were going through a tough time. Yeah, exactly. Because then, like, imagine this happened to you. Imagine the same thing happened to you, but the roles were reversed. Like, do you think that, do you think you would like that? 100% no. So it's like, again, for me, I never, oh, sorry. For me, I never, like, I, I always respond to someone who asks me for money. U usually I don't. Like, I, I barely have money on me at all. I, li I literally carry do not money, I literally do not carry money on me at all. Like, nothing at all. <laughs> do not carry money on me at all. So it's just like, I can't really give anybody anything. I don't have money on me. <laughs> like, I don't even have my, my credit card, and, and even if I did, I'm not going to say, yeah, here's my credit card, right? Like, I can't do that. So it's like, I, I don't know what to tell you, man, you know? Like, at times when I do have change change on me, the odd time, then okay, but I don't mind. I, I'm not going to say, oh, yeah, if you're a son, okay, you know, like, no, of course I help them, or if I can, if I don't have anything, then of course I don't, but because I actually don't. They probably think I do, I'm, I'm just lying, but I actually don't. Like, if I had money, I would, I would give something at least. So, yeah, just try, I would try to help anybody in need, you don't know if you're going to need help one day. And let's say you come across that same person, let's say that person's successful, the one that asked you for help 20 years ago, and now, and now you're the person down on your luck. And then you ask that person for help, the same one that asked you for help years ago, and, that, and then you didn't help, and then they're probably not going to help you either. So, or they'll be nice and say, you know what, I was in your situation, I, I understand I'll help you anyways, but... They, it, it, they could choose to be an asshole, which is good. They're not, they're not even necessarily an asshole. They're just kind of show, like t giving you a taste of your own medicine. So not even necessarily being an asshole, but just kind of like throwing it right back in your face. They can easily do that too, just saying. Anyways, um, with that being said, that is the end of the video. If you guys did enjoy this video, be sure to give this video a like. Be sure to comment, comment down below your thoughts. And be sure to subscribe and turn on post notifications as well. And with all that being said, I'll see you guys tomorrow at noon with another Darwin video. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace out.